in this lecture we will discuss about memory project that also ram project sram project sram memory i will take one port memory i will do with front door access i will do writing and reading access through ports i don't use any task okay without task i will write this is the basic model okay I will do both design and verification with Verilog and as example I take in 5 tall bit memory capacity RAM ok one port SRAM memory project ok design and verification so this is the block diagram here I am giving my clock here reset here enable here write this is the writer in data this is the address this is the reader out data so what is the purpose of this clock timing or synchronization at clock edges this memory can do writing and reading I am using positive edges so this memory can do writing and reading at positive edges ok and this is the reset I am using positive reset when I apply reset 1 circuit become output become 0 so to bring the circuit to known condition I am using reset and now enable ok whether this memory is ready to take the data for writing and whether this memory is ready to give the data reading that status is indicated by enable and what is this write value what is this write when this is this write equal to 1 we can understand this memory is doing writing at that time when this memory is 0 we can understand this memory is doing reading so when write equal to 1 writing when write equal to 0 reading okay suppose when we compare this enable and write suppose enable equal to 1 write equal to 1 what it means memory is ready for writing enable equal to 1 write equal to 0 what it means memory is ready for reading so in both cases enable 1 this write value will change okay so this port is to write the data to the memory this port is to take the data from the memory this is for writing this is the reading ok and this is the address suppose uh, when this enable equal to 1 and write equal to 1 we are writing the data into particular address because there are so many locations and addresses we have to write in particular location so when we writing this address will tell the right address suppose this when this enable equal to 1 write equal to 0 in part from particular address we are taking data so when we taking data also we have to tell from which address we have to get the data ok so this address for reading address and writing address both ok right so this port names in uh, some other some other people they may use a different terminology but ultimate purpose is same ok now I take in 5 12 bit data this is my memory so in each location there can be 8 bits and I take in total 64 locations 0 to 63 this uh, location addresses I given here in decimal if I convert into binary so 64 means 2 power 6 ok so 2 power 6 means this 6 will become the address size number of bits in address address bus size address bus width ok if I convert this uh, decimal addresses in binary I need 6 bit binary to represent each address ok so total 64 locations are 64 addresses are depth is 64 this depth is telling by array and this 8 bits in each location telling by width vector ok if 8 bits in one location every location contain 8 bits so total 8 bits in each location and total 64 locations if we multiply we will get to 5 12 bit size memory ok now we will go to design coding so this is my design code I started with module and ended with end module this is my module name and these are the port list this is the port declaration clock reset enable write or input ports scalar ports address and in data also input ports but both are vectors so I take an address as 6 bit address size I told ok 
and uh, I take in each location 8 bit data okay that's why this size the size is 6 bit this size is 8 bit now if uh, in data write data size is 8 bit out data also become 8 bit in data out data both will become same data same size also same okay so this out data is output port and is it is a regi data type because this out data variable i wrote inside the procedural block at the statement left hand side that's why okay and this is for memory declaration i take in for memory declaration variable as mem it also become regi data type because in this procedural block i used at left hand side statement left hand side this memory variable so it is also become reg this memory variable common to this bracket and this bracket so mem of this bracket indicating array depth number of location 64 and this bracket and mem indicating number of bits in each location this is vector okay right total 512 bit memory now i am writing in behavior style so i used always procedural block to code the functionality and i want to make the circuit as a synchronous reset circuit and i am using pause to clock edge so for this always block this is the begin and this is the end so in this begin end there are two parts this is one reset part and when i release it reset what happen i coded here i am using pause to reset when i apply reset what will happen my output become zero i will get uh, all zero set the output port it is looking like zero there is no base so it is decimal by default if i represent in binary it will be like eight bit binary eight zeros so before the statement begin after the statement end okay so else else means this else is applicable to this reset automatically else become reset become zero uh, reset become zero yes else means so when i apply reset zero what will happen this will execute again in this part i have to tell you different possibilities because there is a enable write like that na so i have to do in this part writing and reading first i have to do write then only i can read that's why this should happen in sequence so for this block i kept this begin and this end for this begin this is the end for this begin this is the end and this is else applicable to this reset and for this block this is the begin this is the end first it has to execute then it has to execute okay so here when i want to write the data first oh, this memory should be ready that's why i made enable one and i want to write the data that's why i made write one so when enable equal to one memory is ready and write equal to one memory is ready for writing take the data okay so this is the statement for writing data so how i will do i will take some data that data i will write into particular address location so this data is going to particular address location if this address is zero this data will go to zero at location address location <coughs> okay so this is writing before the statement begin after the statement end for this begin this is the end now here you can observe this is else if this is not just else if i say else this else applicable to this but now because of if else if this is not applicable to this this is applicable to this only here still i made my retained my enable as one maintain maintaining enable as one and i made write zero because now i want to read do read operation i did writing i want to get the same data from the locations address locations so here also memory should be ready but to, we have to make this write zero so how reading will happen already some particular memory address locations data is there from that location i want to get the data so here i will give this one this is my output to port from the address i will get the data to through output port so before the statement begin after the statement end so this is for reading now else when i don't do reading and writing i no need to maintain enable one okay so now else this else is applicable to this now this is not else if so when else applicable what will happen automatically enable become zero write become one 
so when n equal zero whatever the write value that is no matter so circuit is not ready for reading or writing anything so in that case what will get in my output port i will get all x 8 8x okay so for this begin this is the end this else is applicable to this one for this begin this is the end and for this begin this is the end for this begin this is the end this else uh, else if is applicable to this one not to this one and for this begin this is the end and this else is applicable to this one and before this statement also i can write begin and do later also i can write end here i have not written that also you can do okay right so this is the design code now we'll go to the test bench code so now this is the test bench code so i included file name and uh, you know this part how to write this is the initial block to generate my enable write value input data address everything okay this is the uh, initial procedural block and i have to generate clock also no so for that this is the initial block here my initial clock value 1 and uh, time period i taken as 5 this is the reset initial block initially i have not reset the circuit then after 30 i reset then after 45 again a religious reset this is the dollar monitor display procedural block and this is for finish i take an example 100 so in previous lectures i have already explained about finish monitor reset clock generation everything after watching rom video read only memory if you watch this video you can understand well okay so now we'll see this uh, input generation okay it may looking this uh, procedural block looking huge but uh, it is simple i will tell the logic you no need to worry okay so initially i will made my enable one these all are examples if you understand the logic you can do in your own way however you want values okay so initially my enable one and i made write one so it means memory is ready for writing to take the data so in that case i have to give some data and i have to tell where the data has to go and write so i given data and address also so here data i given in hexadecimal 8 bit data and uh, address i given in decimal 6 bit data if you convert in binary it will become like this okay and after some 10 unit time i changed my i given new data and a new address so this data is going to this address this data is going to this address so in this case i have not written enable and write value it means same previous enable and write value will retain maintain okay so here also right will happen here right will happen here right will happen again i change your address and data same enable and write will maintain here also right will happen after some time i changed my write value to zero and enable still remain as one even i don't write this 27th line it will maintain as enable one but particularly i written okay no problem so here my write value is zero it means i want to read the data so when i want to read the data i no need to give any data i just need to give the address i already written data if i give address i can get data from that address okay so this is reading so reading will happen again after some time i changed another address it means i am asking data from other address location so in this case this write value enable value maintain same as above okay then again after some time i am changing uh, new address i am giving new address to get the data from that address here also write and enable value maintain as above so three writes i did three reads i did whatever the data i given here same data i have to get if i give some same location same address okay again after some time i am i changed my write to one it means i want to write again so here i have to tell the data and address still my enable is one even i don't write this enable one it will maintain as one because of above values all are enable ones na okay again after some time i changed my write to data to zero it means here i did write here i want to read so in this case enable one 
maintain b previous enable okay but here i just need to tell address so here i given enable particularly okay so even i don't give it will maintain previous okay here for reading i just need to tell the address i no need to give any data okay so this is three writes this is three reads this is again fourth write fourth read okay now after some time i made enable zero it means uh, memory is not ready to do writing or reading that will check okay so now see here memory won't work means it is not ready to give the data it won't respond okay not ready to give the data or take the data for writing or reading it is not ready okay now we'll execute this code and we'll check whether it is uh, working uh, properly or not as we code it okay this is the path i will simulate in model sim tool okay cd bracket So click no, and then uh, click on this wave and zoom this waveform to analyze it. So this analyzation of output is important. Then only we can know design is uh, verified properly. Okay. Now this scroll to left side. Okay. Initially, post to clock is coming. How to analyze what is the proper way? Suppose first. Uh, out of all the signals or ports i have to look for reset first we have to give priority to reset so whether reset is released or not that we have to check okay initially reset is not applied then what we have to check we have to check the clock edge so whether positive is coming here or not yes positive is coming okay then what we have to check enable equal to 1 or not memory is ready or not yes enable equal to 1 reset released clock edge came and memory is ready now first what we have to do right we have to do then only we can get the data so right is one or not we have to check okay then you give some data you give some uh, address and in that address you you give some data okay this is my address in this address i want to read this data or write this data okay again I am giving new address and I, I am giving another data to write in this address. You can give same data or same uh, different data, no problem. Okay, but you change the address. Suppose here also if I give same address, whatever the data I will write, new data will update, overwrite will happen. Okay, so now here uh, we'll see. Uh, reset is released, post to clock edge came and uh, enable equal to 1, write is 1 so I given this address okay this address and this is the data we will see same uh, address and data in the test bench whether it is there or not so this second address I given this uh, D1 means five zeros and one this two means six zeros and one zero will come six zeros one zero is the data five zeros one is the address five zeros one is the address six zero one zero is the data okay so during this time I am doing only this first to three only first to three writes so here I won't get any read data that's why this is red color here I am not doing any reading right so now here you can observe I applied reset at this time 
when i apply reset no matter whatever the other values circuit become zero so i am getting at the read port output zero i mentioned in the design i should get output zero until here i from here to here only i reset that's why from here to here only output become zero later it will become a, as per functionality okay right so now where i release a reset here i release a reset and what is the enable value n uh, one so memory is ready okay and here what is the write value zero so memory is ready for reading okay but here clock is not came na so we have to see the clock is positive edge. so in this positive edge now i have to when i want to read the data i have to give the address now from where i have to read the data so i given this address what is the data i kept in this address where is this uh, address see this is what is the data i kept written this one see same data is coming this data only coming see here this data this data this is the address this address and this is the data same data coming okay whatever written same data coming okay you will see some other uh, also so this is also a read here we are getting read data na? okay so now here i made again write one i want to write here so that's why i am giving address and data okay now here see again i did do this uh, write zero i want to read the data okay so in this case what is the address the same address will maintain the same address the same address will maintain so then what data i will get this data only i will come because this is the address same address means same data will come no? okay right coming okay now here you can see what i did enable i made zero when you enable made zero enable memory won't respond no it won't do any write read okay what i coded in functionality i should get x in the output x x x okay that only i coded na okay you can see the design so it is working perfectly as per the design so design is uh, working perfectly okay we coded design perfectly so design and verification of one port sram memory completed okay right